Hello, my name is Rory Nellie II, and I am a member of the Keller Central High School percussion section. I am a freshman and currently play the bells in the front ensemble flash pit. Today, I will be teaching you to learn and play the pad exercise eight and 16th with both right hand, left hand, and double sticking. You may simply watch the video or follow along. All you need is your pad and your sticks. The pad exercise is simply four measures containing both eighth notes, which take up one half a beat, 16th notes, which take up one fourth a beat. The eighth notes in this exercise are counted as one, two, and are played with the leading hand, while the 16th notes in this exercise are counted as one, p, te, ta, and are played with alternating hands. The leading hand will play on one, te, in both the eighth notes and the 16th notes, whereas the non-leading hand will play on the p and the ta of the 16th notes. The exercise begins with two measures that are exactly the same. It starts with four eighth notes, one, te, two, te, and goes into eight sixteenth notes. Three, ti, te, ta, four, ti, te, ta. Depending on the hand you are leading with is the one you will start those two measures off with. So when playing that all together, it'll sound like one, te, two, te, three, ti, te, ta, four, ti, te, ta, one, te, two, te, three, ti, te, ta, four, ti, te, ta, one. If you were to start with your left hand, it would be one, te, two, te, three, ti, te, ta, four, ti, te, ta, one, te, two, te, three, ti, te, ta, four, ti, te, ta, one. Aside from the first two measures we played, the last two measures are an extension of the eighth and the sixteenth notes that we played. These are the same as they are in the first two measures. After those two measures are done, you will then go to eight eighth notes, which are done with your leading hand. So. If my leading hand were to be the right hand, it would be one, te, two, te, three, te, four, te. And then I would do 16 sixteenth notes with alternating sticking, both my leading and my non-leading hand. Or one, te, te, ta, two, te, te, ta, three, te, te, ta, four, te, te, ta, one. When we put all four measures together and turn on our metronome, it'll look and sound something like this. Starting with the right hand. Five, six, five, six, seven, eight. One, te, two, te, three, ti, te, ta, four, ti, te, ta, one, te, two, te, three, ti, te, ta, four, ti, te, ta, one, te, two, te, three, te, four, te, one, ti, te, ta, two, ti, te, ta, three, ti, te, ta, four, ti, te, ta, one. Left hand. Five, six, five, six, seven, eight. One, te, two. Te, three, ti, te, ta, four, ti, te, ta, one. Te, two, te, three, ti, te, ta, four, ti, te, ta, one. Te, two, te, three, te, four, te, one, ti, te, ta, two, ti, te, ta, three, ti, te, ta, four, ti, te, ta, one. When we speed up the exercise and play it twice each time, it'll sound and look like this. This is at 130 with the right hand. Five, six, Five, six, seven, and one, two, three, four, 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 one. Left hand, five, six, seven, and one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Now the double sticking in this exercise is fairly similar to that of chicken and a roll. The exercise will start with your eighth notes, but alternating. So one, te, two, te, or one, te, two, te. Your 16th notes are double stroke rolls, and they will be played as one, t, te, ta, two, t, te, ta. So that would be like right, right, left, left, or left, left, right, right. When playing the exercise together, it should sound like one, te, two, te, 
3t kata, 4t kata. Those are still 8th notes and those are still 16th notes. When we incorporate our double sticking into our exercise, and turn on our metronome on, it should look and sound like this. So we can still lead with the right hand. Five, six, seven, and one. Take two, take three, T, take ta, four, T, take ta, one, take two, take three, T, take ta, four, T, take ta, one, take two, take three, take four, take one, T, take ta, three, T, take ta, three, T, take ta, four, T, take ta, one. Or left hand sticking. Five, six, seven, eight, one, take two, take three, T, take ta, four, T, take ta, one, take two, take three, T, take ta, four, T, take ta, one. And there you go. And that is how you play the 8 and 16th percussion pad exercise with both right hand lead, left hand lead, and double sticking. Make sure to use a metronome when you practice and use good techniques such as good wrist motions and rebound from your pad. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope it helps. And I hope you continue to practice and speed it up and get really good at it. Thank you very much. Bye.